While she was behind the house harvesting her produce, she heard voices coming from the front part of the compound. The old woman and the rich man. Once upon a time, there was an old woman who had lived all her life in her family home. She grew up knowing that the land was hers because her mother always told her so. And so did her mother's mother. But suddenly, one day, she woke up to a knock at the door. When she opened up, she was handed a paper by a stranger asking her to vacate the land because it belonged to one of the rich men in the community. She wondered how this could be possible because she had lived there with her mother and her grandparents. So why would someone suddenly wake up one morning and claim that her ancestral land now belonged to him? She simply told the messenger that she would be awaiting the rightful owner to come himself. Then, one day, while she was behind the house harvesting her produce, she heard voices coming from the front part of the compound. So she quickly went to see who it was. Surprisingly, she saw a beautiful chariot and a rich looking man came down and told her that she should vacate the house because the land belonged to him. She wondered, well, how come? Why could this belong to you? This has always been my ancestral home. Yes, it is now mine, the man said. This made the old woman so sad. But she told the man to please give her some time so she could pack her properties and then vacate the land. The man gave her some time and asked that she hurry because he would be back to take back his land. As she packed her things out of the home, she pleaded with the man to please allow her come back the next morning to pick what was important to her remaining in the home. The man said, no problem. You can come back tomorrow morning then. So she left. Then the next morning, she came back with a bucket. When the man looked at her, he was perplexed. What are you doing with the bucket? The man asked. The woman said, Sir, could you please let me take some sand with me because this reminds me of many people of my family who have been buried on this land. Let me just take sand from this home with me as a reminder. The rich man said, No problem. You can have it. So the old woman filled the bucket with sand. But it was so heavy she couldn't carry it. The rich man looked at her. Woman, how do you hope to carry this? The old woman looked at him. I said, yes, sir. This is quite heavy. And that is how it is in life. We can't carry all this. Where we live, you claim my land is yours. You claim people's lands and properties as yours. But how many do you need with you when you leave the earth? The rich man stood there, perplexed. He then realized his mistakes and told the old woman to have back her land. Do you know that? Sudan and South Africa are the African countries 
with the largest agricultural areas. Respectively, they devote around 113 million and 96.3 million hectares of land to growing crops. Agricultural production varies significantly across African countries in terms of products and volume. Thanks for watching. Love from the classic series.